We celebrate Anzac Day every April 25th, but why is it considered our most important national occasion? The Anzacs, or the Australian and New Zealand Army Corps, were the brave soldiers who stood, fought and died during the First World War. The First World War started in 1914. At that time, Australia had been under the control of the British Empire for 13 years and New Zealand for seven years. In 1915, Australia and New Zealand became witnesses to the new army of volunteer soldiers. The Bray forces went out to the Gallipoli Peninsula to claim Constantinople, the capital of the Ottoman Empire and one of Germany's allies. The Anzacs landed on April 25th, but the Ottoman Turkish defenders were ready for the attack. The soldiers knew that winning was impossible. Nevertheless, they continued to fight for eight months. Notwithstanding the hardships, bloodshed and the loss of over 8,000 lives, the end of 1915 marked the end of the battle for the Anzacs. They were successfully evacuated by the British. The story of the soldiers, the Anzac legends who gave their lives in Gallipoli, hit the hearts of the citizens of Australia and New Zealand. In 1916, they made April the 25th the day these heroes are to be remembered for their sacrifices and their commitment to uphold liberty at all costs. Today, Australia and New Zealand hold special events each year to remember and express their gratitude to the Knights of Gallipoli, who selfishly risked their lives for the common good and for believing that their respective countries are worth fighting and dying for. Lest we forget.